So what if on this ordinary day, God revealed to you something extraordinary? Welcome to the Daily Devo. I am Vince Miller. This week we are in 1 Samuel chapter 9, and I've titled this chapter, Guided by God. Today, we're going to pick up at the point in the story where Saul and his servant are out looking for their father's lost donkeys and decide to go see the prophet Samuel to get some help finding them. Our story picks up in 1 Samuel chapter 9, verses 15 through 17. It reads, Now the day before Saul came, the Lord had revealed to Samuel, Tomorrow, about this time, I will send to you a man from the land of Benjamin, and you shall anoint him to be prince over my people Israel. He shall save my people from the hand of the Philistines, for I have seen my people because their cry has come to me. When Samuel saw Saul, the Lord told him, Here is the man of whom I spoke to you. He it is who shall restrain my people. (laughs) So what we learn here is that Saul's ordinary search is becoming far more extraordinary and still Saul does not know this quite yet. He still thinks he's looking for his father's lost donkeys when Samuel is going to reveal something greater, that he is to be the next king of Israel. And I find this kind of laughable because often this is exactly how I've seen God's providence work in my own life. I am simply living out my life, doing what I'm supposed to be doing with character and excellence. And then God reveals something greater that he would have me do through someone else. And it's often something of greater leadership, consequence, responsibility, and influence. But there are two important details about the role Saul will be anointed and appointed to. First, he would be anointed as a prince over God's people. And you'll notice it's not a king. (laughs) God would remain the king. (laughs) This is slightly different from what the people demanded, even though they would eventually call Saul their king. Second, Saul would have a specific purpose, which was to save God's people, not his people, God's people from the hands of the Philistines. And this is a very specific calling and purpose that Saul would fulfill for the rest of his life. So here's the application. If you are seeking God's guidance today, just remain faithful. Do what God has called you to do with willingness and excellence. And then look up every once in a while. One day you might encounter a fellow believer who will guide you to your next calling on the road of life. I love you guys. I pray this bless you. If it has, share it with someone else and live all in for him who lived all in for you.